The Sports Desk is sponsored by Jim Butler Chevrolet, the Midwest's number one Chevy dealer, 10 years running. Well, this is the lineup the Cardinals trotted out today in Jupiter against the Miami Marlins. And call me crazy, but I think it may be a glimpse at what we'll see on opening day, swapping Gorman and Arenado at DH and third base, respectively. We will find out in just five days. As for today, Genesis Cabrera got the start. He's still battling for a bullpen spot. Cards pitchers only gave up one earned run today. If Lars Newpark can do that out of the two hole, that'll play. He smokes a single up the middle in the first inning. Get Nolan Arenado in the regular season right now. Even his bloops are falling. That scores two. The most impressive thing today was the finish. 21-year-old 2022 draft pick Bryson Mouts strikes out the side to end the game. Cardinals win 3-2. to two. We may not have any local teams left to follow in the NCAA tournament, but that doesn't mean you should stop paying attention. Look at this potpourri of Elite Eight teams. No number one seeds for the first time ever. It'll be a fun finale with some local ties still alive. One of those local ties punched his ticket to the Elite Eight last night. St. Louis native Ryan Kalkbrenner has been an absolute monster for Creighton. He tallied 22 points in the Blue Jays' 86-75 win over Princeton in the Sweet 16. And for the Trinity High School grad, the ride has been a dream. At the end of the day, there's eight teams left, and to be one of those eight teams is just crazy. It means what you work for all year, it's what you work for since you get, the, get here on campus in the summer, and it's just all the hard work play, uh, paying off now. The Battle Hawks will be in Vegas tonight to take on the Vipers at 6. That game is on FX. We are now halfway through the XFL season, and the Battle Hawks currently find themselves in a playoff spot. But they need to win to keep that standing. Coach Beck knows nothing will come easy in this back half stretch. We're desperate. Uh, clearly, we're, we, uh, we have uh, every game is vital. I, that we have to find ways to put wins together now. I kind of look at this last five weeks of the season as your November and December heading into the playoffs in the NFL. This Five on Your Side St. Louis City SC coverage is sponsored by Together Credit Union. Isn't it awesome to go on the MLS website and just see City SC sitting there at the top of the standings all by themselves? They'll try to stay perfect tonight out in Salt Lake City. The team is staying loose and playing with house money. They don't feel the weight of being on top, not at all. We have no pressure, so we had no expectations on us and nothing changed after four, four games. So we think game by game. For sure, uh, the only thing that I can say, we're going to be competitive for the rest of the 30 games. I don't know where we're going to finish, but. Speaking of Klaus, tune in to Sports Plus tomorrow night as I sit down with the Brazilian goal-scoring maestro who has become the biggest star for the new team in town. Of course, we're also getting in all those big Cardinals questions ahead of opening day. And I know it's nice outside, but this is a perfect sports day. You could have sat down at noon, watched the first Cardinals game, watched the second Cardinals game going on, watched City SC, Battle Hawks, and then finish it off with Blues and the nightcap on the West Coast. I so, wish they were here. I wish they were here, yeah. but it, hey, we got the next best thing. That's exactly right. And plus, next week, we will have some games right here in St. Louis. Yes, we will. I'm not going to guarantee you to be dry <laughs> next weekend either, Saturday and Sunday. You know, they get Friday off. Home opener on Thursday. Say it's a 310 start. Odds are the rain holds off until after the game or until the very late innings, and we'll get it in. At least it's mild. Temperatures in the 60s. All we need to do get in five innings. Cardinals get up. We can call it a day. I think we can. Man. All right, guys. That's all of our time here at Five on Your Side at 5 o'clock. We'll see you right back here at 6.